Coastal is a place where Yidden come from all over the world, all different backgrounds. Even Yidden, which don't keep anything, when they come here, they'll put on a yamulka, they'll put on to fill in, they'll say a brach, they'll down with a minyan. But does this really mean something? Their whole life they don't do any mitzvahs. And over here they do one mitzvah? Is that something? The prophet tells us that if we Klai Israel are dispersed to the ends of the heavens, Hashem will gather us all together and bring us territory to Israel. The question is that we human beings, we live on the earth. So why does the prophet say that Hashem will gather us from the ends of the heavens? It should say from the end of the earth. The answer for this is in the words the Apostle uses. It says, Vixer Shemayim, in the ends of the heavens. The word Vixer comes from the word Kotzer, which also means short, a little bit. And Hashemayim, the heavens, usually resemble something spiritual. And this is what the Apostle is telling us. If you have a bit of spirituality, if you have a bit of mitzvahs, if you've done something, if you've done one mitzvah here, one mitzvah there, then that will be enough of a merit for Hashem to gather you together. And this is exactly what Moshe Rabbeinu was saying. Don't worry, as long as you have the Kitzi Hashemayim, a bit of spirituality, a bit of mitzvah, something, then we'll all be gathered together and be brought to Eretz Yisrael. Three years ago, I had a friend in Kamsun who didn't come from a religious background. And every day I put tefillin on him. And I was thinking, is it really so important that I put tefillin on him? He does it for a few days and then he does not gonna put on for the next year until I meet him again. Unfortunately, two years later, this friend of mine was Nifta. And then I was thinking again, I'm like, wow, those few times I managed to put tefillin on him, just imagine Shemayim, those few precious mitts of putting tefillin on him, I'm sure it takes him a really long way in Shemayim. Now that we're only a few days away from Rosh Hashanah, let's internalize this lesson, how valuable each mitzvah that we do is. If Moshe Rabbeinu could tell Klai Yisrael that they'll be gathered in Yisrael, only if they had a small zechus, a small mitzvah, and every single mitzvah we do will enable us to have an amazing year to come. We should all have an amazing Shabbos.